All right, hey, it's a Volonica Veronica with the Change of Love. This is video blog number nine, I believe. I think so. Yeah. Um, I wanted to make this video and just express myself real quick because I'm at work and um, a lot of um, my customers who are coming in, you know, we're talking about Christmas and we're talking about being ready. And um, for those of you who don't know, I do work really, really long hours. And for the last few weeks, this has been everything. This is just everything I've been doing. I've just been working nonstop. And, uh, you know, aside from having change in love and having that as the the movement and, you know, my whole, uh, my whole purpose for even doing the things that I'm trying to do, um, you know, of course, you do have to have some kind of income and you do have to um, have some kind of profit coming in um, to support your means. Um, as much as I talk about not liking money, uh, clearly in the system that we are raised in and that we're built in, it's needed. Um, it's not needed, it's necessary. Basically, whatever you want to call it. But um, I just think that it, it's so crazy how when people get into business or when people try to find a career they, the reason why they get into that is, uh, you know, to provide for their family, to have security, stability, um, to, you know, to not have to worry, basically. To not have to worry, you get into these businesses so that you can spend um, more time doing the things that you want to do so that it takes, so that it's less uh, energy, less effort to do this and I think some sometimes people get uh, confused with those things and um, and then you you know you get mixed messages and you your your priorities change your priorities change um, the person you become is totally different um, now you got a little bit of this and you know, there's more to go around and do, which is okay. That's the whole point of us getting into business and, um, you know, wanting to create revenue. Everybody wants to be financially successful, but the whole point in being financially successful is to so that we have more time to do us and to follow after the things that we're trying to do. And, you know, whatever it is, your leisure, your hobbies, the things that you actually enjoy. And I think that a lot of business people forget that. They get so wrapped up in making a lot of money and, you know, they just forget why you were even making, you or why you wanted to make all that money in the first place. And that's why I don't believe, <laughs> I don't believe in anything like that. Like if, if the intention is changed or it, you know, along the way you just, I don't know, you get too caught caught up in this um, lifestyle, I really feel like that's where you lose yourself and you lose your values, you lose, you know, what your priorities are. Yeah, priority is to, um, it's not to make money, it's to provide security for your family. It's to, you know, have that financial stability. It's to be able to have more time to spend on the things that are more important. And, um, you know, I just wanted to make that video because it's like, I feel like that. I I feel like in any work field, in any environment, you know, you could easily get so caught up in the big bills that you're making that you forget why you wanted to make that in the first place. And um, you know, that's one thing I don't ever want to change about myself. I and that's why I'm, I I stay so focused on this change in love movement because it's. It's really about redefining the things that we were taught and, and the things that we learned and how we were raised and, you know, what we were raised to think and believe, you know. And I, I don't want no one to, like, get mixed feelings about this video, about, like, oh, this girl is just saying this. And, you know, I'm, I'm just saying how I feel because at the time right now, um, I feel like I've been, you know, and I know it, it doesn't stop, but, I mean, still... You work so much 
so that you have more time to do the things you want to do. And I feel like that that's what I do. <laughs> it's like I just I work so much to make this money to help the change in love that like even I stress myself over this shit and I'm like why are you stressing out this is not even you know it's convenient <laughs> it helps it just you know it's enabling me to do the, the other things that I'm trying to do and um, you know I, I just wanted to make that video so that the youth and the young and everyone my peers you know we don't get that shit twisted you know, we don't, like, go and, like, apply for a job and get that job and then spend our whole lives, you know, in that position to make this much to not have anything to do with, you know, with our most of our time, our effort, our thinking, our energy, everything is dedicated to that one thing. And so you lose more time on um, yourself and doing things for for yourself and you know going out and exploring the world for yourself so i just wanted to make that video i know that i'm super all over the place but uh, i'm the type of person where like if i don't talk about that subject that's on my mind at that very moment i'm gonna forget and <laughs> that happens a lot which is why uh you know yeah but anyways uh i just wanted to make that video i wish you all a happy merry uh Christmas and a really special holiday shout out to the Change of Love Street team and all dare, the Dare to Dreamers and our supporters and our fans. Um, I wish and I offer you peace um, in this time and uh, you know I hope that we can just share the love with everyone around us especially in this very so um, hope everyone has a good Christmas um, please reach out to us you you know our Facebook page Instagram Twitter we also have some events coming up we will be making a video on that so change a lot of that <laughs>